Hi! When we talk about financial issues that a startup can have, we always think funding. Do we have enough funding? Do we have enough to achieve our goals? But guess what? Why do you think startups may not have enough funding is because they have not done proper budgeting. And in this video, I want to discuss three issues that specifically lead to you budgeting incorrectly. My name is Victoria Yampolsky, and I run the Startup Station, a comprehensive resource for modeling and valuing early stage ventures. Issue number one is overspending, right? So this is when you estimate your costs and you end up incurring a significantly higher percentage of them than what you estimated, okay? Why can that happen? Okay, it can happen because things may take longer than you thought. Okay, and that's a very common situation in the startup world because you operate in a world of uncertainty, you don't always know all of the variables. So how do you deal with this problem? Okay, two things. Number one, estimate your costs conservatively. It's always better to err on the side of caution Okay, then to be optimistic and try to show a lower budget to investors. And number two, include a contingency. This is your safety cushion that allows you to deal with those um, uncertainty situations where you may end up incurring more costs than you anticipated. Issue number two is overlooking some costs. Okay, so if you are a startup founder with a little or no financial expertise, you may not know all of the costs that you will need to incur in order to operate your business. So how do you deal with this problem is that you go to your advisor that does have that expertise, right? You go to your accountant, bookkeeper, outsource safe or simply an advisor that um, who has worked in finance or are the startup founders and you show them your budget and say is there something that I should have thought of that um, is not here right do you see anything missing and so this will allow you to create a budget that is thorough and complete okay and avoid a situation where again you have not budgeted properly for some of the expenses and finally issue number three is spending unwisely, okay? And so issue number one dealt with factors that were not necessarily in your control. This is very much in your control and stems from the fact that you, after um, having to bootstrap for a number of years, finally got access to capital. And if you raised more money than you should have, then it may result in you being a little bit less prudent then you should be, okay? So you may start going to more expensive dinners, you may start taking unnecessary trips, you may start hiring people that you don't really need to hire, etc. okay? And so the way to deal with that is to follow your strategy, follow your budget that you have put before you raise the capital and do not make any changes to it unless there is a business reason, right? And if you um, don't really have the qualifications to do it, again, my advice is to go to the board. For uh, more information on how to um, estimate your costs, um, I would suggest that you take class number two and um, potentially class number four, which deals with putting together a complete financial model at um, our site, www.thestartupstation.com. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.